Drugs are having a terrible impact in Ohio. Overdose deaths, stealing to buy more drugs, even trafficking and dealing them. Yeah, every school teaches drug education. Today I found out Boardman's using a new approach to inform students. If you don't follow the directions with the medicines, it could be very bad. The Boardman schools have expanded their program, which teaches students the dangers of drugs. This year, it involves more voices and seems to be more effective. I can see the expressions on their faces. They'll come up after the presentations and ask questions. Or, and I actually learn things from them as well, um, you know, terms of things or, you know, the fads or the current trends. On this leg, down this leg here. The program started in October with alcohol and tobacco education plus decision making. It will last 10 weeks. This week's lesson is understanding the biggest drug problem in American history, who it's affecting and how. Phil Merlo spent 20 years on patrol and now he's the Boardman Resource Officer. Now that I am in the schools, I can see where kids, some kids come from every day and um, how they could be affected with their ability to learn and be in the right state of mind when they get here. It knows no economic barrier anymore. Merlo's part of the group providing help for students trying to handle some difficult situations. He points out to the fifth through eighth graders that he's not using scare tactics, he's presenting facts to them. The program's role is really just to raise awareness and make these kids aware of what's going on in the community and giving them the knowledge that they need to make good decisions. All right, one of the big things that students can take away from this class is strategies when confronted with trying something wrong. They're taught to walk away, change the subject, or simply make an excuse.